So welcome back to the channel, everybody. Thanks again for tuning in. Uh, as you can see in front of me, uh, I still have a lot of records that I picked up. This is probably from about a month ago. I had shown them in a pickup video and I got through a portion of them and then sort of forgot that I had these ones lying around. So I don't know if we're going to get through all of them this time. We may split these up because it was about 24 here. So I just sort of see how long it takes to get through them. But uh, and I don't remember what's in the pile. So let's put these down and then we can start pulling them up and be surprised together. So first one is Steppenwolf 16 Greatest Hits. Now this is one I didn't have, but in my previous video that I had done, uh, I picked up Steppenwolf 16 Greatest, 16 Great Performances. So I don't know what the difference is. I haven't checked to see if the songs were the same. There's the back. But, uh, there's no sleeve, but the vinyl is pretty immaculate, so that's nice. Gotta get a sleeve on this one. But obviously, it's just their greatest hits. Um, I like, obviously, Born to be Wild, uh, Hey Lottie Mama, Magic Carpet Ride, The Pusher, Sookie Sookie, and Monster. And probably my. My favorite Steppenwolf songs. So, let's put that there and see what happens. All right. Is this a double? This is not a double. It's a Doors LA Woman. Uh, what's on here? Lover Manly, uh, LA Woman, Riders on the Storm. I don't know if you can see there. So I was never really into the doors, um, you know, as big as a lot of people are. But, um, you know, I do like certain ones, certain songs of theirs. Uh, record seems to be pretty, pretty pristine too, so it's nice. <clears throat> Got it. Change the sleeve on this one, obviously. All right, so that's good. Two nice additions. Um, this is Eagles. This is not, this is a new one as well. I don't have this one. Desperado. It's got uh, Tequila Sunrise, Desperado, uh, Certain Kind of Fool. And I think that's all the ones that I, I'm, I'm a fan of anyway. Uh, nothing special there. I'm not going to pull them all out. Uh, this one's okay. It's got a couple couple scratches on it but it should still play anyway I didn't have it so until I can upgrade it uh, that's a new addition to the collection okay. well I know this one is a double still have the wrap on it Springsteen, born in the USA. For some reason, I whenever I see this, I can't, I can not pick it up. There's something in here though. Oh, there's the sleeve. Okay. Anyway, um, I'll do a comparison for the vinyl, but I think I'm pretty sure the one I have is pretty immaculate. But for me, this is like a solid album, start to finish. Uh, and if you can ever, if you can ever pull up a, a YouTube videos, um, there's some more recent ones where he's done like four replays of this album live in concert, and uh, they're really, really good. 
So that's a double. Pretty sure this one is a double. Eagles, greatest hits. Uh, this might be a condition upgrade because that front is pretty nice. So we will see on that. And I'll check the vinyl as well. But a bunch of good songs. Take it easy. Well, obviously all their hits. I'm not going to say it. Eagles. What's next? Eagles long run? I think this is a double. It's got the long run uh, in the city. Heartache tonight. So we'll see. I'll have to find mine and pull it out and see if it's uh, an upgrade as well. Aside from wear and tear on the sides, it's pretty decent condition. It's the thing though, I gotta stop buying albums that I have doubles of unless I really am certain that they're upgrades. Uh, talking, this is a new one. Talking Heads. True stories. Pretty cool. I mean, so this is definitely one that I don't have. What's that look like? Yeah, you know, I always forget that they got a female bassist. I don't know why that never sticks with me. And album looks pretty. That's kind of cool. It's got true stories there. And on that side, it's got that. Pretty neat. And again, I don't know a lot about the Talking Heads uh, song archive. I mostly am familiar with their videos when they were making videos. But happy to have that one. This one I believe is a double as well, but it could be a condition upgrade considering it looks pretty immaculate. Chicago 16. Um, hard to say I'm sorry. Really, that's the only one I really remember or recognize. Pretty cool. Uh, just tells you about the band. I, mean, I like this side. It's like a computer chip. Computer circuit. So, Chicago 16, I think this one most definitely is condition upgrade for me. Uh, this is a double. Could be an upgrade. It's Bob Seger, Stranger in Town. This has got uh, Hollywood Nights, old time rock and roll. Still the same. So three three fairly decent hits of his. Anything special? We've got uh, I don't know what this is. Pull out. And the song, uh, this record sleeve there. I hate it when they get wrinkled like that. So that's good. I don't know if I have this piece, so that would definitely be an upgrade for me. And that's another thing, too. You really need to take the initiative and 
eliminate. I've done I've done it once already where I've eliminated all my doubles. And uh, I think it's time I need to do it again. Um, this is one I didn't have, surprisingly. My notes are right. Super Tramp, Crime of the Century. Which is a shame because it's got Bloody Well Right, um, Dreamer, Crime of the Century. I'm pretty surprised I didn't have this one yet. Anything special on the inside? Maybe. Got the song paper. A little bit of a picture. I love the sleeve. I'm not, I'm not going to get rid of the sleeve. I love it when it's got like the A&M records and all that kind of record company stuff on it. And um, yeah, just dusty. All right, century. Like so I'm really surprised I, I didn't have this one yet. that in so I'll do that later so don't waste time. What's this? Kansas. This is a double. A double but an upgrade because this is pretty pretty pristine. I always like that front cover. For some reason it always reminds me of um When I see this front cover, it makes me think of Jethro Tull for some reason. It's got a carry on Wayward Son. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Really, that's just the main one. It's got a lot of, like this has a magnum, magnum opus on here where it's a six piece song. It's one of those weird ones where it's like extra long. Check out these hairstyles. Love it. Is that the Magnum Opus one? No. So each side only has four songs on it. That tells you how long they are. So that's cool. That is, like I said, most likely an upgrade. Uh, we'll do a couple more. <clears throat> what is that? Four, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven. This is a double, but probably an upgrade. Chicago 17, 17. Stay of the night, hard habit to break. Um, along comes a woman, you're the inspiration. A pretty decent one in terms of Chicago hits. There you go, what is this, 80s? It's gotta be 80s, right? By what they're wearing. 83. Who produced this one? Um, doesn't say. David Foster, yeah, this is when David Foster came in the picture. Changed their sound, made them more Pop-ish, I guess, and more popular. And this is one I didn't have, that's for sure. Uh, heart, dog, and how do you even open this one? 
Okay, it's a gatefold. Where is it? So it goes like that. You know, you should read it like that. Opens like this. And I guess the back is meant to be a single picture like this. And what's the record look like? All right, it's the same sort of style. I don't know anything about this one. What's... Yeah, I don't know any song on this one. Record is pretty good. There we go. So that's decent. I do have a number of heart albums, but uh, I don't know why I never came across this one before. All right, and I can't get you back in there, so it is what it is. All right, well, we'll leave it at that for now. We won't make this one too long, but leave me a comment below. Tell me what you thought about some of these vinyl pickups and uh, if you can recommend any other ones from these particular artists, uh, just leave it in the comments below. I'd love to hear about it. Thanks again for tuning in, and we'll see you with another vinyl video very soon.